to his God and eat of his pleasant fruits. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you should tell your soul, I'm going, I'm going where I can be awakened in the light of the gospel of Christ. You know why? Because soul ain't so happy. Soul ain't so happy. Soul wants to be happy. Soul wants to be spirit fed. Soul wants to be fed and nurtured in the things of God. So when you're feeling weak and you're feeling down and you say, oh, I just can't. You know, I don't understand why I'm feeling the way I am today. I don't know why I'm going through this. Oh, somebody, the boss made me mad, or the dog didn't do what I wanted to do, or the fish ate too much food and died, or whatever might have happened. Now, you know, soul, it's just soul ain't so happy. Yeah. I remember years ago, my son was back and forth, back and forth, my oldest son, back and forth, in and out of the door, just walking through the living room and out the door. I mean, he just kept doing it back and forth. And he said, I said, he said, oh, I'm just, I'm just tired. I said, what's wrong with you, boy? He said, I'm just tired. I said, you need to sit your soul down. You right, yep, baby? I remember that. Here you yep. go. I said, he said, I'm just tired. Yep. I said, you need to sit your soul down. Because yeah. I knew that's all it was, just an unrest, you know, an uneasy. And a lot of us, we can get we can get like that still. Don't think because we confess them and we're living this life that we can't get uh, an unrest and an uneasy feeling. Now, I get that. I know when I'm uneasy and I'm, I'm feeling so not so good and I just don't feel like I can do it, and I just feel like, ugh, messages, ugh, you know, gross. <laughs> yeah. You know, and you feel like that yeah. Yeah. because you know you to let a part of you yes. go asleep or stay yeah. asleep too long, a part yeah. that's still yeah. waiting to be awakened. Yeah. Either it went asleep or yeah. maybe it stayed asleep too long because it's already sleeping. Yeah. And so it's waiting for you to wake it up, yeah. feel yeah. something, get it out of that place, get it where your spirit is at, it wants to connect. Yeah. Amen? Yeah. Amen. It wants to connect, it wants that connection. Preaching. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Psalm 17 and 15 says, I shall be satisfied when I awake in his likeness. Mm -hmm. These aren't just mm -hmm. weird mere words on a page. Come this on. ain't just Bible page quote. This ain't just something you, you yeah. know, quote one minute and lay your Bible down. This stuff gets on the inside of you and yeah. it breeds what yeah. you're supposed to be into your life, into your new life. It's supposed to attach itself to you. You're supposed to attach to it. Yeah. And you're supposed yeah. to be one with the words of the Lord. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. It's supposed to be you. You're supposed to read this thing. It's supposed yeah. to come out of your bowels. You're supposed to smell like it. Yeah. You're supposed to look like it. You're supposed to smell yeah. like the word of God. You know the word of God. You know the God is there the fragrance, right? Yeah. 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 Fragrance yeah. onto Christ. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> There's an aroma that's supposed to be reeking from you, and somebody comes and say, Oh, what's that smell on you? What yeah. you wearing today? Come on. You don't tell 